guys and gals, my name is Mac and today I'm tired because I normally sleep during the day and I'm up at night. However, I was waiting for a package that said it might need to be uh, signed for. So I uh, stayed up in the morning to, uh, to make sure that I got it, which uh, I didn't have to sign for it, but uh, I have it anyway. So what I'm going to do, be doing is an unboxing. Uh, what it will be is my very first microphone. So let's go ahead and get into it. Now I do stream on Twitch, and uh, so the link for that is going to be in the description. Um, I have been starting to make some YouTube videos on various games and gameplays. I know this isn't the best angle, but I don't really have a uh, tripod or anything here. Um, This is weird it's like a pull tab but it doesn't look like it's a very comfortable or a very solid pull tab so opening it up we've got a uh, box in there another box in the box now for those of you that are looking at microphones currently as of July 2020 uh, microphones are very hard to get if you're in the in the kind of budget range so I'm saying like sub 100 um, because of everything that's still going on right now all uh, microphones for a hundred or less uh, webcams that are around a hundred audio interfaces that are a uh, hundred or less they're all out of stock everywhere and also the ones that they do have in stock, uh, new or used, are like double the price. So, like Blue Yeti, I can't find any of those. There's some uh, snowballs, but I kind of wanted something a like a, the next level up above that. And so, looking in the package here, we've got a uh, microphone there. And uh, the very fun bubble wrap that will be popped later. Uh, and there's a receipt in there as well but uh, here it is here is the microphone I have chose um, it is the MXL uh, V67G like I said I am tired so uh, a little bit spacious so let me open this up uh, really want to rip the box kind of want to keep it oh pulling the wrong area so first thing that I see here is a pouch I don't know if it, it feels like it's leather but I don't know if it really is it might be a uh, pleather but a pouch for the microphone itself and uh, we got some paperwork here. Let me uh, open this up real quick. Uh, a little caution sticker. Uh, one year limited warranty. Uh, I'll have to read that later and see what it covers. And uh, a little advertisement booklet talks about the uh, the polar pattern, which is a, a cardioid. Uh, so there's the information on that. There's the frequency and all that. So uh, this is my first like actual microphone. I've never had anything past uh well this is what i use to film my videos and stream with now just a HyperX headset the standard microphone which is good for uh like discord or uh xbox party but not good for you know a voice over anything so that's why i decided to step up my uh my audio here and so now we're left with some foam let me get this out of the way we are now left with some foam. Take the foam off. And this is what we see. We have 
a mic uh, stand or a mic a microphone holder f to go into the stand or, or arm or whatever however you use it and there is an adapter that is included with that so let me uh, put that back in here oh that's nice and heavy so here we have the microphone itself the V67G um, it does just say V67 on there which I noticed with uh, other models there's a couple of different models uh, at least listed on Amazon um, they'll have like slightly different features but uh, this was in the in my price range and it seemed pretty pretty solid there's no extra switches on this particular model which is fine again I'm new to microphones I'm new to the uh, the whole audio realm so to me that doesn't really do much for professional professional that might be a different story <laughs> really stuck in there there we go there's a little silica packet in there so here it is here is the microphone itself. So I'll go over the reasons why I chose this one specifically. Very briefly, or try to do it briefly. I do tend to ramble when I talk. I just There's just so much going on in my brain and so much I want to say about topics that I care about at least. Um, so the reason why I chose this mic specifically is because uh, like I said earlier, most of the streaming equipment that would be entry or budget uh, equipment is mostly out of stock and uh, overpriced beyond belief. <laughs> you know, so like for instance, something that um, is forty dollars, like the uh, UM2 audio interface that I was looking at purchasing, it's out of stock pretty much everywhere. The only place I can find it is on eBay for. A minimum of ninety dollars, and I'm not going to pay double the price for something that, you know, it's not double the quality. So uh, I'm going to hold off on getting an audio interface. I do have Phantom Power, but uh, that'll be coming tomorrow, so I won't be able to do a test video until tomorrow. Um, but yeah, so and the other reason why I chose this one was because I did buy another microphone a week ago. And it never shipped. I contacted the seller and they said that they shipped it, but it's on hold or something like that. So uh, I'm just going to have to return that one unless my girlfriend wants it and then we'll just keep it. But um, yeah, that one was the Rockville RCM02. And that one was, I thought it was cool, you know, when I bought it. It's got a nice retro look, a uh, vintage look, which is kind of what I like. Um, my hair is normally cut very, uh, very clean cut, but, uh, I still don't feel comfortable going to the barber with everybody still getting sick. And there's every month, it seems like there's a resurgence of the, the illness going on. So I'm staying away from the barber for now, but I generally, uh, you know, I really do like the older, you know, mid century, uh, designs of things, uh, you know, refrigerators, appliances in general, cars, microphones, everything I think about that, that era was just so beautifully designed. So, uh, this has like a very beautiful green vintage, uh, color to it. And then the gold, uh, very, very nice. Uh, now I do have, um, all my accessories that I'll be using with the mic to, uh, set it up. Those will be coming later today. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this video to that video. And so it might not like look good in terms of, or it might not flow very good. And there's going to be a hard break there. Um, but I was t just staying up to get this so I can uh, go get some sleep um, before I have to uh, wake up. And then I'll, uh, I'll end up filming that video and then snapping them together. And then tomorrow I'll be getting my... I have a phantom power, but I need a f the phantom power cable to connect it to my computer. So that's what I'm waiting on for tomorrow. Um, 
And so uh, on Friday, so tomorrow on Friday, I will be doing like a, I don't know, hopefully less than 10 minute video just um, testing the quality of that versus uh, a standard head headset raw. And then I'll do it again with uh, filters on. Um, I'll end up playing with uh, voice meter banana later, you know, maybe uh, later that day. But uh, right now I stream on Twitch or using, sorry, I stream on Twitch, but I use um, Streamlabs OBS to do uh, the to do the streaming. So that's where I have my mic settings. So um, that's what I'll be using for the the tests. Um, just uh, you know, a standard uh, you know beginner kind of setup for streaming. But uh, yeah, so um, I'll be attaching this video to the video that I film later. And then uh, it'll just be one video that I release at the same time. That way it's not kind of, you know, cut up or whatever. Um, so I hope you enjoyed uh, this unboxing. I know it's not the most professional, professionally filmed. Uh, that's because I don't have a, a tripod or an actual camera. I'm just using my phone tilted up against my, uh, uh, my monitor here. Um, All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. I uh, just woke up, so again... A little bit uh, foggy here, but I did get the second package of the day. And so I'm just going to open this up, try to make this clip a little bit shorter so that when I combine them, it's not overly long. But, uh, yep, yeah, so, uh, going to see, uh, what we've got here. What this should be is the accessories for the microphone. I'm hoping. And, uh, again, sorry about the framing. So, this one has zero bubble wrap. So you can uh, kind of peer into what we got here. That up here. Guess we'll uh, start with the one thing that you can see. And that is this. Sorry, trying to keep everything. There you go. So here we go. There's just uh, you can see the brand there. This was a like a twenty twenty ish dollar mic uh, mic stand. I was going to buy a bundle that included all these things together, but I couldn't find one for a decent price that also had exactly what I wanted, so I bought these parts separately. Uh, second thing we've got here is a shock mount. So, it's going to be easier to open up, so I'll open this up and I'll end up setting everything up, uh, you know, cutting the video, setting everything up, and then um, uh, just do a quick... Uh, quick little show and tell of that. So I did get the shock mounts. There are different kinds of shock mounts on Amazon. Uh, a lot of them looked uh, cheaper. They're a different design. So I ended up going with what uh, I see most people have, which is this kind of uh, clamp style. Uh, there's some foam padding in there, which is good. And I was weird about the paint of the microphone getting scratched because it was... Uh, you know, in case if it wasn't padded. So, uh, here's the last piece of the box here. This is a uh, Chemotech uh, pop filter. This is not like a standard pop filter. It's a, it's a bit smaller. Um, so, okay. So it came with some extra gaskets uh, or O-rings. Or um, and here's the pop filter. So it's got these, and the microphone will go in between, uh, and, and there. So, let me, uh, cut the video, and, uh, go ahead and throw this together, and then I will, uh, show it off for you. Alright, here we are. Here's the setup. I finally got it to, uh, to where I like it. Uh, I'm a little bit worried about this, uh, this arm here because it feels a little cheap, a little flimsy. Um, the 
just item description said it held up to three point something pounds and this mic should only be um, a little over one pound something like that uh, based on that item description so it should be able to hold it um, it did come with this uh, thread tape so that it would uh, so if I need to use it on the, the arm I will um, there's the pop filter and I don't know, probably won't be able to see that, but it's uh, rubber banded in there, so it's nice and solid. Now, uh, I don't know how I feel about this one in particular. Um, I might end up going a different route and get a... So X XML, the brand of the mic, makes a gold pop filter with, uh, I think it's like 24 karat gold plated. And it, I think it would match it perfectly because it's the same manufacturer. So I might end up going that route. The problem with that is this was $8. And that one is anywhere from 30 to 50 depending on where you buy it. So uh, I might consider getting that. Um, I did notice that I had a lot of hair on my shirt. And that's just for my dog. She, uh, she sheds a lot. So I uh, apologize for that. Um, I have it... Uh, uh, not zip-tied... Uh, you know, twisty tight on there. I need to get one more just to hold it right there. But, uh, yeah, this seems like it's going to be a really nice setup. Uh, cheap XLR for now. Came with uh, something else I bought, so I ended up keeping that. Um, but, yeah, I hope you liked the video. Again, uh, hopefully a sound test will be out tomorrow. Here's a, kind of a shot from a POV here. So... Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, audio will be out tomorrow, and um, yeah, it's probably just gonna have some gameplay in the background where I test this mic raw and filtered with my headset mic raw and filtered just to see what the upgrade is like. I'm not gonna compare it to any other microphones because I don't have any others. Um, but yeah, if you like the video, drop a like. Um, if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave those down below as well. Uh, I do stream on Twitch, and that's gonna be in the description. And uh, Hope you have a nice day.